So often, we are so concerned about a loved one that it absolutely paralyzes us, that it is more dramatic than if it was happening to us. Many times, that is the case. It says in 1 John 3, verse 2, Beloved, we are God's children now. Do you remember the benediction in the Bible? This is my beloved son with whom I am well pleased. This was first placed upon Jesus, but it is also a blessing of well-being that rests upon every child of God. When your dear ones are meeting problems that seem beyond their power to solve, you remind yourself that they are children of God too, and that they are connected with God and the ultimate help. And when we pray in that way, it has great power. We don't pray within the problem. We pray a positive prayer for them, believing the best. A prayer like this, Child of God, I see you moving onward and upward to greater good. You envision your dear ones free, unlimited, and confident in every way. You see them as beloved children of God, endowed with all the qualities that they need to live a happy, free, satisfying, and fulfilling life. You know for your dear ones that the light of God shines in their mind, guiding them. It shines in their heart and gives them strength, for God upholds them. Their lives are taking on an onward and upward direction toward greater good. God is the great overcoming power in their help, in their need. And you see them, as I see them in prayer, moving confidently through every experience. Know that they are a child of God. Know that they are connected with God. Know that they are one with their help.